This is an abandoned observatory. It's got three telescope domes. It's the later one that was built in the 70s. That one in the 60s. There's another one further around. That one there also in the 60s. I'll try the first one. Just a little brick built one. It's got like a winding thing there for the roof to open. Then you put a telescope to the stars. Like the box first. Let's see how it works. Alarm box. User guide for the control panel. Lights. Some air extinguisher there. That's the first one. The second one. Let's force this one open. The paint spew on the top. The winder. I think that's gonna happen. Nah, it's stuck. It's got a little hatch open there. The telescope we got at the top. A few things inside. Which isn't quite nice. And a winch. I think that's for the, the sides to come to go around the open. I'll get the third one. I've already checked in this one, you kind of get in. This is the one that holds the 24 inch telescope, which is one time one of the biggest telescopes in, in England. That's in there. That's in there. Brown and Hood Limited. Carville Works, Walls End on Time. These were built in the 60s. I hardly see in there, but the 24 inch telescope is still inside there. Obviously, I didn't break it anywhere, so I'll not be breaking that. Well, there's a gap at the top there, actually. 
Hang on. Nope. I'm gonna pitch all out the end. Yeah, all the way in. The little later one from the 70s, these two from the 60s. That one holds the, the 24 inch reflector telescope that I kind of get in, and that's it. I managed to take the step ladder out of one of them because the hatch opens at the top. I'm broken, it just opens. Have a look inside. That's a, a 24 inch telescope that's that at one time was one of the biggest in, in the UK. So you kind of get in there. So it would gone up and then the roof would open. I'll jump in there. <laughs>